G'day guys, Scotty Lyons here from The Hook and The Cook and welcome back to our channel. Now as a fishing guide, I don't get many days to fish myself, but there's one species that I want to tick off my bucket list and that's a marlin. Now I managed to get out a few times this year, but unsuccessful. So sit back and watch this great footage and I hope you enjoy it. Have it guys, we've got uh, a spread of four lures out. I've got two out wide, two in close, and now it's just a matter of covering as much of the water as we can. That in about 50 fathoms, uh, that's where the good waters come down and, and come in against the coast. And that's where most of the marlin are being caught at the moment. But this will vary every year when you come out. We've got a couple of marlin just in front of us here, free swimming along. He's a red bar. Oh, he's not liking that. Oh, Jesus. Not up no, that's not him. He's feeding that one. He's feeding that one. Oh, no, that's him. Why is your line over there? Yeah, that's not yours, bud. No. Well, a bit devastated after uh, probably five, ten minutes of uh, the fight for my first marlin, we pulled the hook. It took the littlest lure that we had out there, and uh, yeah, we pulled the hook. And, but that's the way it goes with marlin fishing. 
So we'll get them set again and fingers crossed we can come across another one. Well there you have it guys, the highs and lows of marlin fishing. I'll tell you what exciting stuff. And I'm sure I'll get out there next year and give it another shot. Now tune in next week for another fantastic clip on the hook and the cook. And remember you can subscribe to our channel, you can follow us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram and we'll see you here every Friday at the Hook and the Cook. Cheers guys.